Welcome to Frog TV's FAQs. I'm Adam Baker. Guys, each week, myself and our travel consultants are helping you with the most frequently asked questions. As ever, if you have a question for us, let me know in the comments box below and I'll get straight back to you. This week's question, what travel insurance do I now need for Costa Rica or a trip to Costa Rica? So let's find out. What kind of travel insurance do I need now for Costa Rica? Uh, Jake, what, what do you tell? What's the immediate answer? Is there a specific type of travel insurance? Uh, it's just a basic policy that covers you for fifty thousand in medical and two thousand in extended accommodations. Okay. Very easy to get. There's a wide variety of options. Um, you know, the national policies range about eleven dollars per person per day. Um, if you want a more comprehensive policy, there's options for that. And if you want a more or less expensive option. We have options for that as well. Nice. Uh, Justin, what are some of, do you, do you have some of the specific names or like partners we recommend? Yeah. So, well, ENDS is the, the Costa Rican insurance company. I don't know if a lot of people are purchasing that one because it's quite cumbersome. It's all in Spanish. Okay. Um, Sagicor is another national brand that a lot of people have been doing. And then also this new Tradewick, I think is what it's called, Trade Tradewick. What's interesting about Tradewick is you can actually exclude insuring your trip and the policy just covers that $2,000 extended stay in the medical and it's quite affordable. But then also we have Traveled Insured International, which is a comprehensive plan where it covers everything. Your traditional travel insurance, you can include flights, you know, injury while you're here. It's not just COVID related expenses. So those are the four plans I've been recommending. Nice. So, so Seb, like Justin saying, that makes sense. That it's, it's basically travel insurance. Just make sure you're specifically covered as well for COVID when traveling to Costa Rica. Exactly. It's just like planning any other trip in this case, because of the current situation, it's just an extra policy, but we got also covered with all the options that Justin just explained. And that makes things really easy. Nice. Have we had any issues with insurance policies so far? I mean, we've been, as, as you say, guys, since August now planning vacations again with this new policy, has there been any issues with storage or anything we've had to deal with? I'm not aware of anybody testing positive yet. Okay, touch wood. We all got wood here. Seven, some right there above you. You can see a lot of it. So there we go, guys. I hope you found those responses helpful. If you're looking for a more detailed response, please get in touch with me and I'll help you out as best as possible. As ever, please don't forget to subscribe by clicking just here to stay in touch with everything Costa Rica related and new content every week. For Frog TV, from all the travel consultants and myself, Adam Baker, hasta la próxima.